It's a hot ticket tonight, and we here at EA Sports are so excited to bring it to you. Along with Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Let's get ready to play this one. Foot's one of those guys who's an attraction selling tickets for this one, Ray. Dangerous offensive player. He can skate and shoot the puck. Any team would be lucky to have him. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. Joseph's got it in the offensive zone. Great save from in tight. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. The Monsters are on the attack. Pokes it away in his own end. Sends the pass over. Syracuse takes possession of the puck. Here they come up along the wing. Nice pass. And they fail to go tape to tape. Feeds it down low. Cutting to the front of the net. Denied that one. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. The Monsters have it from their own end. Syracuse gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Angles it over to Smith. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Strong defensive effort. Keeps a hold of the puck. Syracuse has it near the wall. From the left wing, takes the feed. Syracuse has it against the half wall. From in close, denies him in front. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Takes the pass. Here's a short pass to Gallant. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Syracuse has the puck. Into the attacking end. The Monsters get a hold of the puck in their own end. Tries to feed it across. Here's an odd man rush. From point blank. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Smith's hauled down. Penalty on the way. Gains the zone from the right side. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. Stays with it. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Regains control here in the neutral zone. Excellent stick work on the play. Too much traffic in the lane. And the puck's booted away. Here comes the official's call. Pretty cut and dry trip on that play. Coaches will tell you, be careful with your stick, but you're trying to get the puck. I yeah. don't think a lot of times they do it intentionally. Here's a first look at the power play. Now, uh, you know, James, I like offense. I like goals. I even want to hear one of your goal calls. You haven't had a chance tonight. Clint Dennings lugging the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Looking to break out here on the power play. From the right side, moves it up ahead. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Gains the zone through center. Can't connect. McKinnis plays it along the wall. Syracuse tries to break out from their own end. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Cleveland's across the blue line. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed and we are still tied. These are the power plays that drive coaches crazy. They didn't really generate anything. They didn't force the penalty killers at all. Kind of a waste of time. More than half the period left to play. We're still scoreless. Nice job tying up his opponent. Answered the call on that play. Maintains possession of the puck along the blue line. And now he angles it across to Mateau. And a strong effort on that play. 
Uh, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter. There's nowhere for the puck to go. From the neutral zone now. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. The setters will glide into the dot. Scott's won it off the faceoff. Cleveland's in transition. Quick pass to Scott. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Moves it quickly over to Colton. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Manages to hang on. And that goes off a player in front. Here's the chance to set up now. Syracuse glides it near the point. Takes the feed. The Monsters carry it along the wall. Slides the puck over. Syracuse plays it along the wall. Cleveland's got the puck along the boards. Sent in deep and the forwards will go to the bench. Up along the wing. Steps into all of that. Can't find his man. The Monsters are in transition. And now he tries to get it across to Gallant. Great hit on the play. Comes up with the steal. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. The Monsters have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Pokes the puck away. Great feed from the left side. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Couldn't complete the play. Gallant's got it in the defensive end. Cleveland's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Syracuse on the attack. Wow. He scores! You know he was nervous. The rookie gets into his first playoff. That first career playoff goal will help him relax. Excellent shot. He gets his stick into position to deliver the puck. Goalie thinks he's got most of it covered, which he does, but not enough. It's just inside the post. The Crunch have taken a 1-0 lead here in the back half of the first. I've always found them to be a better team when they can use their full bench, and that's easier to do when you have the lead. Cleveland's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Simpson. Here's a chance. And the extended stick ends that one. And he regains control of the puck. There's the physical side. Great defensive effort with the strip. And now he moves it to Sherwood. Receives the pass. Moves the puck. Moved in front! And that's broken up. Syracuse looks to break out in their own end. Cleveland's got a hold of it along the wall. Right in front! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Smothered that in close chance. Quick feed to foot. Takes the feed. Along the half wall with the puck. Maintains possession. Pass back to the point. Takes a shot. That's blocked. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Protects the puck around all sorts of danger. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. The Monsters will play it against the wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. That's a great heads-up play to break up the pass. Cleveland's got possession at center. At center. Sends a pass over. Save made by the goalie. Handles the puck. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Here's the pass. And he comes up with it. Takes the feed at the point. Quick feed down low. Here's a short pass to Winkowski. Clint Dennings taking it from his own end. Gets it back. And now it's over to Scott. What a great read breaking up the pass. No one home on that play. The Monsters have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Scott. Jostled off the puck. 
Through center along the wing. Syracuse plays the puck along the boards. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Comes up with a stop. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got... Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. There's the whistle penalty coming up. I know he doesn't like the call on this one. Nobody does, but I think he has a case here, Ray. Well, it looked like the penalty was going to be called, and then it got sold even more so. So that's a hooking call that he doesn't really like. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Let's one go, and that one stopped. Good save, positional save through traffic. The replay will show us that he's in good position and makes an excellent stick save to turn away a really good scoring chance. The Monsters have had their opportunities, but they just can't capitalize here in the late stages of the opening period. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. And the puck clears the zone. Taken along the wall by Thomas. Well, that'll do it for period number one and a chance for both teams to kind of get a refresh here. Syracuse has a 1-0 lead after the first 20 minutes of play. Solid effort at both ends of the rink. Are you looking to impress at your next group event? Then both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Your time is now to reserve your seat in one of our extravagant luxury boxes. See our website for details. Both teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Sabalski ready to bring in the call for period number two. Cleveland's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Couldn't connect on that pass. Gives it right back. Scrum ensues along the boards. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Clint Denning's got it along the boards. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Syracuse does a terrific job intercepting pucks in the middle of the ice. There's another example there as the play dies and this game remains close. Grabs control of it at the point. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Power play is over. Both teams back to even strength. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Knocks the puck loose. Good use of the body on the play. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Sends the pass over. Syracuse plays it against the boards. Quick pass to Joseph. Let's it go. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck to his chest. Since made this part of his game, he levels his opponent here. Still plenty of time left in this frame. one nothing the score. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Here's a shot! Big time stop there. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Misses the net! Oh! That's frustrating. You, you get yourself into position. You don't get many of these chances a game, and he doesn't get it on net. Syracuse has possession of it now. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Nice pass. Takes it right in the chest! And we're going to get a stoppage here as the referee blows the play dead. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. 
The Monsters move it in. Puck battle along the boards. Big play inside the defensive zone. Grabs the puck in the corner. Here's a blast. Denies him with the save. Gibson's got the puck, and he's going to go for the whistle here. He hasn't had a lot to do this period, but he's been excellent and has been able to control the pace of play. Man, he pounded that shot, but the goalie was in good position and made the save. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Couldn't find the intended target. The Crunch have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Takes the pass. Syracuse plays it along the wing. Makes the save. Good battle along the boards for the puck. The Crunch have taken possession along the wall. Cleveland's got the puck in their own end. Moves it up. Cuts to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Nearing the midway mark of the period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Loses his balance on the play. Nice pass back. Nothing doing on that. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Cleveland's got the puck against the half wall. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Easily turned away by the glove. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Big save by the goaltender. He takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Pinned up along the boards. Cleveland's got the puck along the wall. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Sherwood's been called for holding. I got a laugh here. The player says, what are you looking at to the official? And he's like, you holding him. Putting the grab and clutch and grab on that one. Syracuse is set to go back to work on the power play. Hasn't been many opportunities tonight on the power play, but here is one. We'll see if they can take advantage. Fails to find the open man. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Collins plays it now. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Syracuse takes possession along the wall. Takes the feed. No, you're not going to get away with that one right in front of the official. Delayed penalty coming up. It's a tripping, it looks like. And he's heading to the box for two for tripping on this one. This is such a bad penalty to take because you put yourself yeah. in a bad spot. A player falls down. Now you're cooked. You go to the box. Well, he's got two minutes to think about it now. And with that call by the officials, it's a long five-on-three set to begin. When this puck is moved side to side on a five-on-three, you're going to rotate those penalty killers around. Eventually, you're going to tire them out. I don't mind taking a shot, but it can't be a bad one from the wing. Get it on the net. And he takes a shot. Stones him with the blocker. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. Syracuse has it behind the net. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Takes a shot with the stop. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, it's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. Moves it quickly over to Smith. In close! And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. More than half the period has expired. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Joseph's won the draw. A chance! You can hear it all the way from up here. 
Lots of times I miss playing, James. That's not one of them. I like I'm in a suit right now. That one hurt. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Gallant. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. We'll get another look at that hit. The boards don't move, and so that hurts the way he finished them in. But look, the glass is still rattling from that check. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. Grabs it in his own end. Syracuse has it in the defensive end. Slides the puck over. Strong defensive effort. The Monsters will play it in their own end. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Forces the turnover. Gains the zone from the right. Syracuse tries to break out from their own end. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Moves it to Gallant. Looks to set up at the point now. Takes a shot. Great save by Gibson. Colton's won the face off. Scooped up along the wall by foot. Can't catch up to the pass. Syracuse gets the puck near the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Colton's carrying it ahead. Receives the pass. Answered the call there. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Back at the point, they set it up. Cleveland's got the puck along the boards. And all alone on the breakaway. What a back check effort there. Sometimes you're in a race with the wrong guy. The forward had room. All of a sudden, it's all gone. Tremendous. His reflexes on display tonight. Moves the puck. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. With possession along the wall. The Monsters scoop it up along the boards. Takes the feed. Takes a shot. And he makes the save. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Here he is in front, and they can't convert to the play. Sends a pass over. Here they are on the attack. Hangs onto the puck. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Handles the puck and loses possession after a solid hit. Tangles him up with the stick, and the officials are all over it. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Here's the official call. This is a good old-fashioned hooking the call here. He looked like he was water skiing. Man, you got to move your feet. You get your stick around his waist, you'll get called. Syracuse is ready to go back to work on special teams. Well, here they go with another power play, James. I mean, they've screwed up their previous ones in just about every imaginable way. Now it's time to wash that and re-attack on the next power play. Syracuse gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Takes the feed from the left side. And he coughs it up with the pass. Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Syracuse has the 1-0 lead. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Quick shot! He scores on the power play! Taking advantage of the extra man, move the puck well and get on the board. Shooter's able to corral that saucer pass, and then he beats the goaltender.
Syracuse now has a 2-0 lead, and you know what? It could be much more. I think they're a little unlucky only to have two. They've had the puck most of the time. They just haven't been able to capitalize till just right then. The Crunch have possession along the boards. Second frame almost done. Well inside a minute now. 18 minutes, 48 seconds. Sends the pass over. Scott swooping in on the attack. Nice pass. Sends it out right in front. And they can't connect. Puck scooped up by foot. Enters the offensive zone from the left. And that'll do it for period number two. Syracuse leads by a pair after 40 minutes. They lead it 2-0. Fans, your donations have made it possible for kids in need to see their heroes live. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Been a great night for hockey so far. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Let's drop the puck on this third period. Barring extra time, the final frame of this one. Here we go. Third period is underway. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who was at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Cleveland's frustration's pretty evident. They've had all kinds of chances. But that goalie down there has been amazing. Takes it to the net. And that one's broken up. Clendenning's got it in the defensive zone. They go on the attack through center. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Nice poke check. Syracuse has it near the wall. Here's a shot and puts it just wide. The goalie was late reacting. If that puck hits the net, I think it's in. Takes the pass. That knocks him off the puck. Syracuse has it in their own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Here comes the sentence. He's going off for tripping, and doesn't everybody feel like they're innocent on a trip? You feel like you're innocent on most every penalty, but this one always feels like, nah, did you really have to call it? Another scoring opportunity looms here. If your power play's successful, you can really take the wind out of the other guys. You've been successful all right with the man advantage. See if you can get another one. Cleveland's in now. 53 seconds. Jabs the puck away. Scrum along the boards. And the puck's knocked loose. The Crunch have gained possession off the wall. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Couldn't complete the play. Cleveland's got it along the wall. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Handles the pass at center. Moves it around along the half wall. Quick feed to Smith. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Let's get another look at that hit. This is a glass rattler right here. He thinks he's got room, but he doesn't now. He's up against the wall. Lots of time left in this period. Syracuse is enjoying a 2-0 lead. Smith's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Here's a chance, and that's broken up. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Syracuse has been the more complete team tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Considered a win for the penalty killers as the power play fails to execute. Oh, another good penalty kill for them, James. They've done the job start to finish when they've been shorthanded. Gaunt takes it inside his own end. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Gaunt's picking up steam. And we've got a two-on-one. And they can't finish that one. Oh, 
That's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. Slashing the call here on this one. Now he got his two minutes worth there, James, as he's fishing away, and all of a sudden he takes the stick back and whacks him pretty good. Power play unit comes out for the faceoff. I always felt on the power play, the first one was really important for any team. If you stumble around on the first power play, guys start to press as you get more and more of them through the game. Here's a shot, and too much traffic in front blocks that one. Big time defensive play. Fires it into the offensive zone. Cleveland's got a hold of it against the wall. Mateau's got the puck along the wing. Now a quick pass to Simpson and tries to make a diagonal pass to Sherwood. Moves the puck along the half wall. He was right there and they can't convert. Skates across the blue line. From the point, looks to make something happen. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Gibson's had to do his part. He's had a good night in the goal, but at the other end, they've been really sharp around the net. Slides the pass over to Mateau. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Passes right to the front. Scores! Perfect timing to get a marker here. Well, they finally punch through. They've been working at it late in the game. They finally get on the board. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Cleveland's come back with a big one here in the third. Grind away, dig away, now you got a chance. Only trailing by one goal. The Monsters win the faceoff. Couldn't make that one happen. The Monsters played along the wing. Takes a shot. Syracuse moves ahead with the puck. Takes the feed. Cleveland's got possession here in the neutral zone. The Monsters take it along the wall. And that's picked off. Grabs the puck at center. Passes over to McKinnis. Receives the pass to his teammate. From the place 99 made famous. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Here's a short pass to foot. Back to the blue line. Denies him on the play. Here's a chance behind the net. The Monsters gain control of the puck against the wall. Great defensive effort with the stick. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Passes right to the front, and that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Gallant's moving the puck through his own zone. Cleveland's moving it up the ice. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. Let's see what the official says here. The crunch have to serve two for tripping. Now reaches in with his stick and he'll go to the box. The Monsters once again send out their power play unit. They've been trying to push for the tying goal. Now they're going to get an opportunity on the power play. Grabs the puck here in their own end. And manages to clear the zone. The Monsters have it behind the net. Cleveland's moving it along the wing. Keeps hold of the puck. Back to the point it goes. Cutting to the front of the net. Turns it away. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. He flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. It's a 2-1 game. Smiths won a big draw on their own end. And they get the puck out of harm's way. The Monsters gain possession along the wall. Here they
they come up along the wing. Puck picked up by Mateau. Oh, what a save with the stick by Gibson. Tough enough to make the save unless you can see it. He's got to fight his way and find the puck. Battling for it along the boards. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. And the play is whistled dead. Let's see what the call is made. The Monsters will serve two for holding. Player's got a little bit of a beef here, but when you reach out with your arm, that signals to the official to keep a closer look. It's a penalty no matter how you shine it these days. Syracuse has a chance to really change things on this power play. Well, they've earned another power play, James. Of course, that starts with an offensive zone faceoff. They've had success earlier in the game. They'll want to double up on that now if they can. Slides the puck over. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Scoops up the puck off the draw. The Monsters have possession shorthanded. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Knocked off the puck. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. Takes the feed from his netminder. The Crunch have gained control of the puck along the wall. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Here's a shot and makes the save. There's the save we were talking about earlier. This game can't stretch out anymore. That's a critical time for him to make that save. Here in the late going of the frame, Syracuse leads it 2-1. Smith's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Can't connect! Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Time runs out on the power play, and you do have to wonder if that might come back to haunt them as both teams are now back at even strength. Wow, that seems like a big miss, James. Critical moment in the game, and the power play laid flat for them. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Syracuse has it against the half wall. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Takes the feed and makes the save. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Syracuse has the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Cleveland's got a hold of it along the wall. It's a three-on-one. Stopped by the goaltender. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Grabs the puck. Approaching the final minute of regulation. Nice zone entry from the middle. On the attack along the boards. Cleveland's got the puck along the wall. The Crunch have taken to the offensive attack. Here's a chance right in the slot. Oh, puck doesn't get there. So crowded in front of the goaltender. From the right side, they gain the zone. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Cleveland's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Misses. Passes ahead from the right side. Puck dumped in, and the forwards will head off. Scrum ensues along the boards. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Cleveland's gained possession along the boards. Oh, what a birthday present that is as he scores! I guess in the great context, it doesn't really matter, but it does feel great to score on your birthday. About five years ago, they started to pull the goaltenders a little earlier. The coach makes a good call here. He gets his keeper out and now they're able to punch through with their net empty.
The setters will glide into the dot. Colton's won the draw. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. And that pass goes awry. Quick pass to McKinnis. Regulation time comes to an end. That means we've got some overtime coming up. Join our fan club and receive a membership card. Discounts on team merchandise and team ringtones as well as email notifications on upcoming promotions. Overtime's and coming up in just a matter of moments. Events. We'll be back right after this break. And we are just moments away from overtime. Will we get a winner here in overtime as we are underway? Good hit on the play. The Crunch have the puck against the boards. Syracuse is on the attack. Shot! Oh, what a stop! Cleveland's got the puck. Boom! Man, he's been on it all game from the very first shift. Finish your check. Move on to the next one. Finish another. Stays with it. Manages to hang on. Moves it quickly over to McKinnis. And we got a delayed penalty coming up here. Let's see what the officials say. Foot's getting called for tripping on the play. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go <laughs> serve his minor penalty. with a four on three and they've got lots of time to work with here oh thank you very much a power play in overtime a chance to put this game away you've earned the power play now you want to make sure that you cash in Gibson's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle quickly on top of that James he needed a cover there well what a quick reflex stop that is great scoring chance a big draw looming here in the offensive zone. The Monsters win the faceoff. From the slot, wrist shot, stick save by Gibson. And he came out and challenged a good save. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. The Crunch have to spend the next two minutes under man. He's trying to slow him up, trying to impede his progress a little bit, but he gets too much of a grab, and now he'll go to the box. The Monsters with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. Hard to believe that's another penalty in overtime. How many chances do they need? This power play's got to put it away. The Monsters have it against the wall. Slides it over with pace to Mateau. And a poke check knocks the puck away. No for that shot to go through. Whoa, close call on the bench as the puck sails out of play. A critical draw here. Cleveland's got it in the offensive zone. On the backhand, stopped by the goaltender. They fight for it along the boards. Puck slid down the ice. The Monsters scoop it up along the boards. Moves the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. Centering pass in front, and that one's broken up. Great block there. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Looking to break out here on the power play. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Here's a chance with the stop. The Monsters get a hold of the puck along the boards. Gibson. The Crunch have taken possession along the wall. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Still anyone's game as we approach the final minute of overtime. The Monsters move the puck in the defensive zone. Oh, that's a good hit. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Monsters can't take advantage of the overtime power play. 
Sometimes the opportunity shows up at a really critical point. Here you are in overtime, you got a power play, and they don't cash in. Big miss. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Smith's won the draw. Here's a shot. He usually hits the net from this spot. He's going to be disappointed with that. Game of inches here. Move to the middle for the win. There he was. He misses the net. Syracuse with possession in their own zone. Cleveland's got control of it now from their own end. Through center. Passed up ahead. Sends a pass over. Just wide of the net. Oh, he worked hard to generate that shot. He just misses wide. Syracuse moves it ahead. They've got numbers. Sends it across. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. With the steal. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. Time runs out on OT. And we are heading for a shootout. The coaches are getting their lists ready. We have a quick moment to breathe, and the shootout is up next. Throughout the arena. Thank you, fans, for joining us in the campaign to save energy and keep our city clean. Neither team has given an inch after three periods. Nothing solved after overtime. So here we go. Shootout. Let's go. Alexander no goal. Didn't have much in the way of creativity there as he gets shut down. First shooter for the Monsters, number seven, Paul Bittner. And he comes up empty handed on that one. You stand out at center ice and you're ready. You got your plan and sometimes you just don't execute it. Next shooter for Syracuse, number 46, Jamel Smith. Makes the save! Focused in on the puck, gets himself in the center of it, and makes an easy stop. Here's a great opportunity to take a stranglehold on this shootout if he can deliver a goal here. Doesn't go. I'm sure he had a different plan than that. Well, maybe that's part of the problem, James. Maybe he had a couple too many thoughts in his head. Really important to just whittle it down to one thought, one reaction. He didn't get it done. Witkowski's the first skater up for round number three. We still haven't got a goal so far in this shootout. Doesn't go. Really had a chance to turn up the temperature there. Yeah, it's going to keep this interesting as the shootout does not spread out. The table is set. The cutlery's all in place, and he can be the hero right now. Scores! Good night! Coach has him at the end. He's got a lot of faith in him, and he rewards him with a nice goal to wrap this up. And this one is all over as the final horn sounds. It's been back and forth all series long, and here we sit after four games all evened up. These now. guys must feel, James, like they've run into the wall four straight days. <laughs> no kidding. And nothing's accomplished. The wall's still in the same place. Now it becomes a short series. This has been intense. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.